I mean, sometimes I think we like to think of Jesus as I mean, God's sensitive side. You know what I mean? And, and, and have difficulty reconciling this Old Testament God with Jesus of the new. And we're just like, oh, those pieces don't really fit, right? We just try to jam them together. But that's like being confused why a single puzzle piece doesn't look like the image, the completed image on the front of the box. Jesus was not the sweet heart, but the whole heart of God. What does this mean for us? Well, it means what he did, who he spent time around, what he said. Every God-saturated syllable, Jesus, was the needed measure for this immeasurable God. And when we miss this reality, we in the church, we end up wasting a lot of time doing things that Jesus never said we should do. We end up spent, spending our time like, like uh, not with, but avoiding the people that he would have us draw near to. And we end up talking a lot about things that Jesus never talked about. But when we get this, when, when we really get this, what happens is we start reenacting the narrative put before us by Christ, hinging our life upon his life. If this is how he loved, so will I. If this is how he forgave, so will I. And then we'll see the body of Christ faithfully living out its purpose to make visible the invisible qualities of God, both in our homes, our neighborhoods, our cities, and our world. 